people are gonna come over and be like, that's a nice ceiling. It looks like you got that professionally done. And you can say, Andy Man. Hey guys, welcome to the third episode of the dining room series on the adventures of Hamdi Man. In today's adventure, we're gonna, ah, so much better. Today we're going to prep the ceiling to be spackled and then ready to get the painting going. It's gonna look great. This is one of those steps that a lot of people miss because if you don't sand what you already have, the paint trying to hold on, it makes it really, really tough for it to do. So let's get into it. Mm. There's only a couple of things that you need today to do the sanding on your ceiling. The first thing you need, sanding block. The best kinds are between fine and coarse sandpaper. Pick a medium grit sandpaper. It really doesn't matter as long as you know what to look for and I'll definitely show you what to look for. Second thing you need, patching trowel. You don't necessarily need this if you got everything off the first time. I got most of it off, there's just a couple of small spots that I need to redo, so that's why I'm keeping it today. It's always good to have around just in case you have to scrape off just a little bit here and there. One thing I didn't get to mention in the last video, masks, sanding masks, any kind of 3M respirator masks. These are really, really good for people that don't normally scrape popcorn ceilings. I didn't wear one because I know where to stay whenever I'm scraping so that I don't inhale anything or get it on me. So what I would suggest is wearing one of these whenever you're scraping the ceiling. Today I'm definitely wearing one because there's gonna be so much more dust. And don't forget, apologize in advance, one, if you can't hear me very well, but also two, if I have to take the camera out mid shots, it's because I don't want the camera to get dirty. So we're gonna hope for the best. When you're sanding, sand in circles and make sure to change arms so that one doesn't get overly tired and you can continue doing the ceiling. You see that? That came off my ceiling. If I wasn't wearing my safety glasses, that would have went right in my eye. Safety glasses save lives. Do not forget these, especially today. Check it out. This section right here, all done. Scorpion from Mortal Kombat? Get over here! Remember your patching trowel can double as a knife. Watch. If you have crown molding and they put caulking at the top, it's gonna be hard for you to scrape it off. So, that's what the patching trowel is for. Secondary knife. Oh yeah. People are gonna come over and be like, that's a nice ceiling. It looks like you got that professionally done. And you can say, no, 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 that, that, that was all me. And then you do this. It's like the apocalypse in here. Just everywhere. you 
guys to see something. You see how it's gritty, white, and nasty? That is a post sanding surface. The difference will mean when you paint, it's gonna be so much easier. Thanks for watching my latest video. If you like it, as always, hit the like button. If you're new here and you really liked it as well, hit the subscribe button. I've got more content coming soon, so stay tuned for more adventures of... Next time on the Adventures of Hamdyman. Ah! I'm so close. Look how close I am. Well, I, I wish I could show you, but this is all I have left.